something been very interesting in my experience is that people are using bikes bikes so much both uh, in the summer when of course it's much easier but also when weather is not 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 so good in fact my own experience of sort of biking a little bit around copenhagen uh, starting many years ago has been has been wonderful and uh, you know if you look at indian cities today uh, people ride bicycles because they have no option so the people who don't have options in terms of public transport uh, either walk uh, or they use bicycles and they're typically people who are not uh, you know very well to do they're relatively poor so bicycling uh, in india like it was in china earlier is seen as uh, the only option that a poor people can a poor person can use uh, and you know as soon as somebody has a little bit of income uh, they would like to move on to a motorcycle and once you go beyond that then you want to go to a car so the whole aspiration to get into motorized transport and you know the linkage between that and uh, and social status are very strongly tied together and i think one has to change that plus of course the other thing that we've been having for the last maybe 10 15 years is is that traffic accidents have become an epidemic uh so we have very uh, very high levels of mortality i think you know maybe there are probably 150,000 or 200,000 people who die in traffic accidents in india and i think about 2/3 of them are pedestrians or cyclists so one of the reasons i have uh, i have had stopped cycling in delhi I used to cycle for maybe 10 15 years to work and back is because it's too dangerous because we don't have uh, separate cycle paths uh, there are no special crossings for bicyclists and essentially the motor cars have completely taken over the space so you know and as soon as you start having uh, uh, you know expressways and 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 flyovers and things like that and the grade is you know relatively high it's difficult for bicyclists without uh, uh, without gears to get onto them Uh, it means that they get excluded from 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 traffic so a mix of uh, status um and the fact that uh, you know it's dangerous to drive uh is is a real real challenge so i think you know from copenhagen uh, what you have here is an independent system where cyclists are safe uh there are enough cyclists on the street so you're not sort of isolated as far as it's concerned and there's a culture in which you can actually use it plus of course you have public bicycles <clears throat> which of course is something that you know we've never had in india it might be difficult to implement that because if you had lots of public bicycles you'd have to have millions of them otherwise like in netherlands or in 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 uh, uh denmark or or you know in other parts of scandinavia uh, you'd have so much of bicycle uh, theft that the, the the police would be spending all the time doing that so it will have to be probably private bicycles in india but we need bicycle paths uh we need access Uh, and i think the real test is if if young young people can actually use bicycles to go to school <coughs> uh the other question of course that we have is that our cities are starting to sprawl a lot they're becoming very large so it in 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 the hot weather it becomes a bit of an issue if you are bicycling 2 3 kilometers it's all right if you're doing 10 or 12 uh two ways that's about 25 it becomes a bit of a stretch it's not that easy to do so it's also a question about urban form and how you plan the city that that becomes important but basically we've been driven by the car and we have to try and reclaim that space as much as we can so examples from other parts of the world you know paris is now try try to copy what's happening here and stuff like that the, the more more cities that do that and use bicycles as a means of last mile transportation is actually very good